So I want to add a yes and to the community events. Um, it's so it's fun and easy, in my opinion, to find these community events for our clients. So what you can do is set aside. Well, let me start over. What I do is I set aside a couple hours each quarter to look and see what's happening in downtown Martinez. And then I put that in a MailChimp email. It's really like a fun email. There's at least 10 events on the emails. And then um, I send that out to my clients on MailChimp. But then at the beginning of each month, I also look and see what's on the calendar. And then I pick out, oh, yes, that's happening. It's a family event. So then I send it directly to them that way. So you can kind of feed two birds with one scone and go in and look and see what's happening, put it in MailChimp, and then also hit them with it again. And also, um, there's a really, really, really great book. And it goes to what we're talking about today. It's called Ninja Selling. And it's essentially um, like taking in. Oh, yeah. Feed two uh, birds with hold one on. I stone. Think so. I'm like, yeah. the, the, bird, the birds love scone. Yeah, because I don't like kill two <laughs> birds with one stone. I think that's so mean. Feed two birds with one scone. Okay, I'm just that. making sure I heard you right. I was like, wait a minute. Yes. <laughs> yes. Also, we don't skin a cat. We dress a cat. Yes. Uh, okay. Yes. So, um, Ninja Selling is such a great book. It goes into, um, yes, talking to our clients, how we talk to our clients. It talks about the Ford questions, family occupation, recreation, and uh, dreams, and how we bring those up in conversations with our clients so that we don't feel robotic to them when we're talking to them. Right. So, I highly, highly, highly suggest that book. If you guys haven't read it yet, it's Ninja Selling by Larry Kendall. And it also has really good ways of hyping yourself up when you might not feel like you're up 